What is up guys, Faded here and welcome back to the channel for another video. And today I've got the Lenovo IdeaPad Y900. It's finally gotten released. It's got a GTX 980M. They could not get the 1080 models or anything like that. I'm not sure why they just didn't wait and go ahead and go with those. But we finally got this with the 980M. Now it's got 16 gigabytes of RAM. It's also got a 1 terabyte 5400 RPM hard drive and also a 128 gigabyte SSD. It's a 17 inch display so there's a lot of real estate there. Um, but let's go ahead and get the box open so you can see what is inside the box. Now, all right, let's see. quite a large computer. It is quite hefty as well. So there you have it. Real nice Lenovo gaming symbol right there. Turn it this way. This is actually how it's supposed to be viewed. Got your Lenovo logo up here. Your rear exhaust. I guess this is going to be your intake. And probably your sub right there. And... Okay. All right, I'm gonna move this box and then show you guys. We'll see what's in the box first. Let's get this out of the way. Okay, all right, so your power cable, which goes with your power brick. Um, wow, that's quite a, a hefty power brick. It's like the size of a DVD case. Speaking of DVD cases, this is a, let's see, a DVD burner, so gotta have a cable but it's a portable DVD burner because I know a lot of people complained about not having a drive but now this thing about this PC is it's got a mechanical keyboard on it and it comes with red WASD keys as opposed to I'm guessing black and your useless startup guides and I don't know if anything doesn't look like anything is in there let's get this box out of the way and let's pick up Okay, let's go. All right, so let's open this up. All right, so it does look like it has the the good the good old um, anti glare coating on it, which which I'm probably just gonna go ahead and rip off. Now, it does have a mechanical keyboard, like I said. Listen to that. That sounds amazing. But anyway. They've got a new rubber stop resistant coating down here. So it's going to be real nice to rest your, your palms on that and deal with your touchpad. And hopefully this will be a good touchpad this time around. Um, I don't see JBL anywhere, so who knows if they went with JBL. But they do have a turbo button right here at the top, which we'll learn more about that in the review. But you can just turn, turn turbo on. Um, I think that only does it for CPU because I know you can overclock this CPU, which is going to be cool. But yeah, guys, that's about it. I'm going to go ahead and turn it around. You guys let me know if there's anything that you want to see in the review. Um, I'm going to be doing some game plays and things like that, so let me know what games you would like me to play, uh, specifics to be in the review, um, and all of that. If you have any, you know, random requests like boot times or anything like that just drop them down in the comments as soon as possible and let me know and i'll try to get those out and put on the youtube channel as soon as possible but anyways guys thank you so much for watching please leave your comments down below and also leave a like and so and if this is your first time here go ahead and subscribe and i will catch you guys in the next one